Hello, everybody. I am Michael from Pebble Podcast. Today we have some extremely interesting news.、Uh, it turns out that in 2015, NCSoft will be releasing a Pena game for the Android and iOS platforms on the phone. Which this info just came out of nowhere, and I'm extremely excited. They released a trailer. We have that、uh, running right now. And what struck me the most. Was was how different the graphics are and how different the art style is. So as you can see from the trailer, the the graphics itself are very very stylized, but they're not as kind of like anime ish as they are in the PC and Wii and PSP versions. They definitely take its own art style, and they it it kind of reminds me of the other game that. Uh, Natree Pez in Korea, the horse riding game. I think it's Alice or something.、Uh, I'll show a picture of that right now.、Um, and it's just—it's such a strange announcement. As much as I'm excited for it, I'm kind of worried in some way because one, it's on a phone, which you know, like if it was on a console or if it was on a handheld, like it was before, like on the Wii or the PSP. Then it would feel, I think, a lot more structured. And obviously, if I was on a HD console now, it could look a lot better. Because,、um, like, well, this does look absolutely beautiful.、Um, just like little things, like you know, low polygons and stuff are present, especially in the courses.、Um, and that's another thing: the courses, from what we can see in the trailer, are extremely different to anything we've seen on Panya. You have similar elements, like. For example, in the screenshot, you can see if you look in the background, there's a lighthouse from Blue Lagoon. It's the same type of area, but the art style itself is very different.、Um, and I don't know why they kind of changed it. I still kind of, you know, I don't know how to feel about the art style.、Uh, but another thing that they changed a lot, apart from the courses,、um, is the character designs. They are extremely different from anything we've seen before in Pegna. Uh, they still do have returning characters, like they have Lucia, they have Kaz,、um, stuff like that. But just like in the PSB version, you can now play as caddies. So you have like Lola, you have、uh, I believe Cuba and Tiki, and just all the characters.、Um, and then I think there's some characters that they kind of haven't announced yet that are completely new, kind of like Cyan with the PSB version.、Uh, there's this character that kind of looks like Speaker, but she doesn't really have a name. Um, and then there's some characters that were actually the、uh, the NPCs that were never playable in any game. They were just kind of like in the menus. I'll show you a comparison between the two,、um, and they're like from the clan of Pania Island or whatever. So I'm glad that there's you know a big big variety of different characters and caddies that we can play as. Um, and something that was really cool is how they're using Dolphini this time around. Dolphini seems to be like you know a boss. There's like a boss mode where you can like use your character and hit a fireball into Dolphini, and he's like a pirate Dolphini.、Um, and there's different like you know Dolphinis running around the place, and it's a lot of new and crazy ideas that they have with this game. And I'm really looking forward to it.、Um, <laughs> Something that kind of got me off guard was they completely redesigned Titan Boo. Like it doesn't even look like Titan Boo anymore. Like look at him, <laughs> it looks completely different.、Um, so just things like that. I don't know how I feel. It kind of feels like they're striving away from what Panya is and what made it so popular. What made it so popular is the art that Panya was brought up with,、um, who was. Actually made by a very really good artist, Sea、um, Dark. So sadly, he passed away, and ever since then, they've been kind of like, kind of getting off track with the art style. They haven't been really like trying to get it the same. It's kind of like you know turned off to like slightly realistic, but very anime-ish still.、Um, and I still don't know how this is going to like incorporate. Like, is this an official Panya game? Sure, it's an official Panya game, but like, 
I don't know, it doesn't feel as official as, say, Panya Wii or Panya PSP. It kind of feels like one of those spin-off Panya games, like that uh, Panya spin-off game where it's actually tennis. Like, table tennis. I'll show you that right now. Um, some of you might not even know that exists, but it only exists in Korea. So, I don't know how to feel about this. If it's a full-fledged, really good game, just like the PSP version, or just like the Wii version, I'll be completely fine with this. I still don't know how they're going to price this, or even market it. I mean, they've got a trailer, so there's certainly starting, and it doesn't come out till 2015, we still don't know the date. But, I don't know, just this whole thing, it's very sudden, very confusing. Um, I, I'll give it a chance, I'm looking forward to it, and, I don't know, it just, I think because it feels and looks so different to the Panya that we know, it doesn't feel like it's Panya. It feels like it's a rip-off of Panya, or like, a spin-off of Panya, but it, it just doesn't feel like Panya. I think that's my only issue. Like, even the characters, they just don't feel or look like Panya. Um, and I think a lot of people also going to feel that too, so... But anyway, uh, I'll have an in-depth like trailer analysis of this going like frame by frame, talking about what possibly like these modes or what this course could be, and that will take a little bit of time. So I'll put that up mm, maybe like tomorrow or something. It'll come soon. Um, but we're going to try to cover this as much as we can, just like any Panya news. And this is the biggest Panya news we've had for quite a few years, ever since like the PSP version. So yeah, um, I want to thank you guys for watching this video, hopefully you're interested in the game too. Uh, tell us what you think below or on the forums or whatever, and I would really want to know you guys' opinions because maybe if enough people are interested, maybe they can bring it over here too, just like any other Panya game. So thank you for watching, and until then, bye!